हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक ऑन माय चैनल टुडे विल सी अपेंडिंग मल्टीपल टेबल्स इन पावर बीआई एंड आल्सो विल सी द डिफरेंस बिटवीन मर्जिंग एंड अपेंडिंग टेबल्स ओके सो लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड इट फर्स्ट सो अपेंड ऑपरेशन क्रिएट्स अ न्यू क्वेरी दैट कंटेन्स ऑल रोज फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट टेबल फॉलोड बाय ऑल रोज फ्रॉम अ सेकेंड टेबल ओके एंड इन पावर बी वी कैन अपेंड टू और थ्री टेबल्स विथ ईच अदर एंड इट इंक्रीज द रोज इन द अपेंडेड टेबल and it creates a taller table while merging two tables creates a wider table by increasing the columns so the difference between append and merging is append increases the rows in the table it means it creates a taller table and in merging it increases the column numbers in the table so it wider the table okay see it in the power bi how to create the appended table okay so in power bi desktop we need to import the three dip different tables we are having these three tables so we are having the sales data for 15 sales data for 2016 and sales data for 2017 so we are having these three tables in our power bi desktop and we need to append that three tables so that we can have all data in only one table of 15 16 and 17 year okay so for this operation we need to go to the query editor from this transform data option okay so after going to the query editor we will see we are having these three tables present so first of all we need to check the data type of every table so now we are having the same uh, for order date we are having the date data type so from here we can change the data type so we need to check all the columns from all the tables so here also we have order date in the date type and here also okay so then we need to go to this append query this option present on the home ribbon of power query editor below the merge queries option okay so here we are having this drop down present we need to click on this append queries as new option okay we can use the append queries also so here uh, we are having these two options concatenate rows from two table into a single table okay so we uh, now in this case we are having three or more tables okay so we can append more than two tables also so for appending we need to click on this option then we need to click add then we need to click here we need to click add and 2017 it is there okay because we have selected this table first then we need to click over this option okay so it will give us the appended table of 15 16 and 17 okay so then we can we can give the name sales data of 15 16 and 17 okay so after renaming we can check the data type and all the data so after doing this table we need to click over here over this on on this drop down then we need to close and apply the changes so it will replicate in the power bi so here now we have all these three tables and one in this table now we are having the different all the years present okay so for analyzing all these tables are connected or not we need to tag this year from the appended table we need to tag the year in the table so here we are having 2015 16 and 17 and after appending this table we can create any visual that we want to analyze the this three years data okay so we can add any visual from here and we can analyze the data as per our requirement okay so this is about this task we'll see next task soon till that do subscribe my channel please like and share it with your friends thank you for watching my videos and don't miss to press the bell icon so that you can receive the notification of my upcoming videos thank you so much